guys, how's it going? It's Double Hook King RMC here, bringing you the second episode, season two of our Let's Play series of Minecraft. The reason why I'm whispering is because there's an enderman somewhere. Honestly, I've been digging here for like the past. Oh, I didn't look at him. Oh! Darn it! I did not see that creeper there. Nor did I hear him. Okay, I'm just gonna leave Mr. Ender Enderman alone here. I'm just gonna continue on here. I hear another Enderman nearby. Oh, you guys. Oh, you guys. Oh, you guys. I didn't look at him. No, I didn't. <laughs> I'm running out of food. No, I'm not. I got bread right here. I need to find a village or something. Oh, he just ate the last bread. I hate it when he does that. I, I'm trying to mine out something, dude. Ah, your aim sucks. You should feel bad. Okay, where's my shovel? Ooh. It's gonna be quite the fight I'm gonna be... Okay. Well, I'm just gonna go up, back up the base here. It was swell being here. So how are you doing today guys? <laughs> I meant to ask you that earlier. Hope you got hope you enjoying you guys' day. Um second episode here of season two. Pretty exciting. Not really. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Everyone's cheering. <laughs> oh yeah, I don't even have my helmet on for one. And to make bread. I'm gonna need to mix this up with wheat. Do I have my, uh, is my furnace, my, not my furnace, my crafting table back over here? Bet you it is. I haven't been in this area lately. Not, not that much. Um, I might just abandon this, uh, this area here. <laughs> as you can see, uh, it's when I got started last episode. And then I happened to just walk back up here, la-dee-da. And... I happen to find that, or not that, this over here, or over there, somewhere around here. Sorry. It's over here. Okay, I'm gonna get back over there. Oh, that's where, oh, that's where I seen the sand. Okay, makes sense. Alright, that's the last one I'm doing here. And, oh, that's done anyway, so that's pretty good. Alright, can't wait to explore over there. I didn't even see that, I thought that was just a plain mountain. But it's not. We are going on a trip on our favorite rocket ship. Zooming through the sky, little Einsteins. Whoops! Darn it! All right, now that all this silliness is over, time to get serious. Let's uh, let's do some exploring here. Um, four, five. Whoops, four, five. And then put all that. Well, it's four. That would be 17. You can tell I'm not very good at math at the moment. <clears throat> Even though, yeah. But Kinger, you're in college. You should know about math. Well, I don't. Anyway. Oh, and another spawner. Really? How lucky can, how lucky can I get? Okay, I gotta run. I gotta run. Gotta run. All around. Oh, buddy. <laughs> Come on, little guy. What you got? What you got? Holy smokes. Okay. I can't even hit these guys. 
Like, what's going on? Ouch. Okay, so good. So yes, this, this I like. I like this world a lot because we've got spawners galore. Um, the entrance way is blocked here. It's strange the way. It's it's yeah. Oh, beetroot seeds. Aha! More bones to collect. More bread. Uh, oh, we got a saddle. We got more coal here. So that's pretty cool. We got a saddle. That's pretty cool. And we got ourselves another. Yeah. And I got to get rid of most of these here. So what do I got to get rid of? Well, I got an, well, I got a bow. I could probably repair that. It's hard to get rid of stuff here. That's all I'm going to get rid of for now. Oh, oh, and I got a music CD. Nice. What's this one? Music disc. Cat. Ooh, I'll take that. So, first thing I found at my base was a skeleton spawner. And now, as we approach here, we have now found a zombie spawner. That, that's uh, the next thing after our XP farm from the skeleton. We're going to use this zombie spawner. And I know the perfect way to set the zombie spawner. Zombie spawner. The zombie XP farm, I should say. I have a few good ideas here. Probably be able to pull it off. Probably not in this episode, but probably later on in the future, of course. When I collect some more items. Um, I don't really want to get started on, on technical things like right away. I just like to, since I'm starting fresh, and it's been months since I've played Minecraft, I would like to, how I, I would like to get the feel for things here first before I do anything else such as going mountain climbing which is all I always wanted to do no I'm just kidding um, I'm surprised I there's not even a village around ouch around here why isn't there a village around here I wonder kind of strange but I'm sure we'll bump into one sooner or later I'm sorry I'm just walking around aimlessly and pointlessly when I talk I just I talk and I don't really multitask too well. I can, but at the moment I'm I'm doing pretty well multitasking. It's just that when you have nothing, uh, when you when you don't have any ideas in Minecraft, it's kind of hard to ex to talk and explain on what you're gonna do for the episode. And yeah, it's it's not easy. Okay, why did I make that? That was pointless. Oh, I I know why, but I don't have enough. Uh, <laughs> Okay. Okay, definitely gonna need to light it up around here. Since I said it's pretty dark around here. So what I'm thinking here is that if I clear all of this out and this spawner does work, if if correctly, I could make a path I could make a water path that goes down goes down here and pull the zombies. It will uh bait uh pretty much Eventually, hopefully when this works, but I'm just picturing this. This is like only like a rough idea But I'll have water right here and water flowing right here. The zombies will spawn And I got to figure out how where what like what kind of radius they will spawn at. I'm pretty sure it's not not uh, too much I'll have blocks set up right here Our blocks water right here and they will probably come here and then it'll probably pretty much fall to their death 21 blocks is it 21 blocks down? I uh, Last time I remember, I think it was 21 blocks down. Uh, not to their death, but they will fall and take enough damage where you can just give them exactly one hit, one punch, whatever. Well, whatever. And they'll be dead, and you'll have some XP points. <clears throat> Infinite XP. Huh? Like it? I thought so. You guys probably already knew that. But, uh... <laughs> I decided to explain it anyway, so just deal with it. I made more torches than I than I probably should. I originally intended. All right, I'm just gonna do this off camera then. Nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Right here. So <clears throat> basically, what I have done so far, I've just counted how many blocks I should go. So that's basically uh, one, two, three, four, five. 
six, seven, eight, nine, about twelve. So I was about, so I was about right there. So far, so good. So all I gotta do is, is with this one now. I gotta make it a lot more. Yeah, I gotta do it all on top here. And hopefully, when I, when I get this done, it will look good. I have to make some buckets and find some water. Um, hopefully this will work. Um, guaranteed that it might not. I don't know. It's hard to tell. Um, there is going to be some testing though. I will test this to see if it will work. Um, I haven't really tried it uh, creative mode yet. Which I don't really want to, just to spoil the surprise for myself, just to see, because I heard before it didn't, it didn't work before, but, I uh, we're at 1.10.2, so, <laughs> okay, so I'm going to need, need some glass here, just to encase this, so I can see that the zombies are going to, are going to flow right through here, um, yeah, I could just, like, lay some water right here, actually, and then it'll just, and they'll eventually push all of them down there. I think it'll work out fine. And then I'll have like a water coming from there. And oh, I'm just going to need, this is going to be quite the project I'm going to do here. Or we're going to do. Um, maybe I could just have an opening right, probably right here. Nah, I'll just have a, not a wide opening, but... Probably, yeah, I think I'll just have to have a wide opening here. There's going to be a lot of water it's going to require. Okay. But hopefully, if everything goes right, and the spawn rates are pretty cool, this should, this plan should work. Hopefully. All right. Well, if this, uh, if all this comes to plan and and all turns out very well, this should work. Cause I like the. Hmm. I like where this is going. This is yeah. But I just realized there's there's a I think these mobs are going to interfere with this I think they're going to interfere with the spawner or are they up there oh they're up there's something up there how did I miss this how did I miss that I did not even see that oh Oh, there's multiple ways you can go here, but they're probably all dead ends. No, they're not. Oh, I wish they were. Oh, that doesn't sound good. Wait, what was that? There's... Oh, there's nothing here. I'm just lighting it all around here, just because I don't want no mobs being around. I don't want no mobs spawning around here. I don't want no interference with that spawner. I don't want nothing interfering with that spawner whatsoever. That's why I have it light lit up around this area now. So it should be all good. I'm still hearing this freaking skeleton somewhere. Oh, he is down below. Oh, what's going on down here? Let me just put a torch here. There. <laughs> and also put a torch in the spot too. <laughs> Actually, you know what? 
Just to make it look out of place. I'm gonna put that there. Let me do some testing here first. So, where's my glass? I need my glass. Oh, and I still need one more to craft here, and that should be good. Um, all I want to do is just take a look at, uh, to see how everything goes. And the reason why I have glass here is so that the zombies don't see me and that I don't interfere with anything here. Okay. Alright, and now we're going to start by taking off all these torches. Okay, it started. Okay, this would be like an AFK farm. Oh, I didn't turn that torch off. Okay, I'm gonna have to break the glass here. Now it's good. Ouch! Leave me alone. All right, I'm gonna go AFK here just for just for a little bit here. So I shall be right back. All right, so it's a little loud, as I have found out. Hostile creatures have to turn down. All right, it's been roughly about 10 minutes. So let's go and uh, take a look. And, uh, oh, it's nighttime too. Can they still see me? No, they're not trying to get me. Look how many zombies there are here. Holy smokes. So there's about entities, 99, 18 entities, eh? Hmm. 18 entities. On here. In here so far. So that's pretty good. That's not too bad. So. Sorry if it's dark. You can't. I don't know if you guys can even see that. But there's about. Eight, yeah, there's about 18 entities in there. <laughs> and I'm gonna have to kill all these guys. One by one. This guy here. Get that shovel. Eat my shovel. Thank you. Oh, and there's still some over there I gotta kill. Okay, this is gonna take a while for me to do. And I seem to be running out of food as well. Okay, took care of all of that. Getting a lot of XP from this. Okay, I gotta close that now. And I gotta kill these guys again. Excellent, excellent, alright. So that's what we need, that's perfect. Perfect. Now... I don't know how, I don't know how well it's actually gonna work entirely with this water but I'll try and see what what, ha what will happen if I have all of this open so and if it does work then that's a bonus I might have to just make this a one by one space I guess yeah I'll make it a one by one space Or, I don't know. I actually haven't really figured out how I'm going to get down there. I'm going to figure out... Oh, that... Yeah, you know what? That's what I should have thought about. Well, I don't know. I have lots of time to think about... Oh, there's water down there, too. I have lots of time to think about it. And... I have to, oh, I got an... I got a carrot. I just realized that. Okay. But, yeah, that's... uh. Whatever. I'll I'll figure it out. We'll we'll work we'll work this out together. Um Oh I took the wrong way, didn't I? 
Oh, it's down here more. Okay. Alright. Get most of this done. Should I have it just like maybe just here? Think that would be a little too a little too much. Or what I can do. Well, I'll just I'll actually I'll just do this first. Clear space right here. And then the rest of it will be water. It's got, we're gonna need lots of water though. I'll have to do this off camera. Well I'll get the materials off camera, guys, yeah. So, this video is getting a little too long, reaching the 21 minute mark, so I'm going to have to uh, wrap it up here in this episode. S so, you guys ready for this? This is what I got done so far with the mob spawner. Ta-da! Yeah, pretty exciting. Um, I still got to get it finished. I was doing most of this off, uh, off camera, trying so hard to figure, uh, figure out what to do. I found a picture online. This is where I got it from. So I have, think I have to go 31 blocks up. I think and then I'll have to somehow make them drop somewhere 21 blocks down. But I'll figure it out uh, off camera or maybe in the next episode. And also I also found something out over here, down here. But I'll show you in the next episode. <laughs> Suckers. No, I'm just kidding. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Um, got any suggestions, just comment below. See you in the next episode. Take care. Bye-bye.